I'm going to do another unboxing video again today and um, I have no idea what I'm going to find inside this box because check this out. Look at the damage there. That's one thing I don't like about UPS is they don't have issues with damaging boxes. In fact, there was one item that I ordered. It got so badly damaged in shipping that they sent it back and the company that uh, sent it didn't replace it. I didn't care. I didn't pay for it. So, so hopefully what's in here is not going to be too badly damaged. I mean, one of the things can't be damaged. It's not like glass or anything. But something. Okay, this isn't too bad. Looks pretty good on the inside. Let me, I'm going to adjust the camera and I'll explain a few things that I got here. First thing is this here. This is a knife sheath. Um, I'm going to try to figure out how to get open. And I don't think this is going to work for my needs, but I ordered it because I couldn't find anything better. I've got this knife, right? And beautiful knife. Really nice knife. Very sharp. It came with a plastic sheath, but the problem with the sheath, if you're not careful with it, the blade pokes out from the end, and I have stabbed myself with that. So I thought maybe a leather sheath would work better. But I am concerned that the shape of the blade, oh, maybe that'll work. And it goes in all the way. I can snap it shut. There's no sharp edges anywhere. Happy with that. I think that cost me like, was it $19 on Amazon? Very happy with that. Speaking of knives, I couldn't resist that this one. I got this um, through Amazon Vine. If you're not familiar with the program, uh, you can request some things. They'll send them to you for free. Not anything. There's limits what you can request. Um, but you can request them and get them for free. And your only obligation is you got to write a review. So this is one of those Chinese cleaver knives. It's got little plastic things to protect the corners. Ooh, I can tell by dragging it across my nail. It won't drag across my nail. That's a sharp knife. And this probably does not come with a sheath. Nope, nothing else in the box. So, I'm just going to box this up again. I don't need the plastic. And I'll figure out what to do about that for a sheath. But I want to try that. I've never owned one of these Chinese... Uh, chef's knives. I think this might be fun to cook with. Okay. Set that way to the back over there. This is a taco form. Where are my scissors? I don't, why did I put my scissors down? Over here. It's going to cut a piece of tape here. Because what I want to make is cheese tacos made out of cheese and we'll talk about more than that in a bit okay and these come four to a box they're forms that you you make your your taco shells and you put them in there to let them cool off so they stay in a nice shape um, you can put like a chopstick down in the bottom to make it stay in the bottom and um, as I said it comes four to the box. Um, each one will hold three. So that's something I'm going to experiment with, with something that I'm going to call chacos, cheese taco, or choco shells. Okay. 
set this aside. I'll deal with that later. Okay. The big item is this right here. This is the one I was afraid might get broken, but the box looks good. It is a waffle maker. I've been looking up online at Chaffles and their waffles that are made with cheese rather than the usual um, batter. And the reason why is because I have recently been diagnosed with diabetes, type 2 diabetes. I'll toss that down there. And then I thought, um, if I can eliminate bread, like my hamburger buns when I make cheeseburgers, if I can use chaffles instead of the hamburger buns, that's one source of carbohydrate that I've eliminated. Okay. And I bought this particular model. Oh good, directions. Toss that down there. Because, that's the spill plate. What's in here? These are just spacers, I guess. There's nothing in there that I need. I got this because I don't know how to open it up yet. Um, I have to read the directions. And that's what I thought. See? It's cracked. It's got a big crack in it. Going to have to send this back to Amazon. Can't test it. Oh, that disappoints me. Oh, there it is. See, it broke right off. Broke in shipment. What a disappointment. Okay. Well, it's going back. Thanks for watching.